Hi, I'm Caitlin Remsen with Central National Bank, and I have a confession to make. I have never once met anyone who actually enjoyed paying bills, myself included. In fact, a recent study found that people don't like paying bills for the following reasons. First off, bills cost money. And let's be honest, no one likes seeing money leave their bank account. Second, sometimes you have to travel to the post office to buy these things called stamps. And third, who wants to lick an envelope? Really? But I'm here to tell you there's an easier way. With BillPay, you can schedule and track all of your payments in one centralized location. Centernet Online Banking. Don't believe me? Well, I'll show you. First, we need to log into Centernet. So here we are logged into Centernet. We're going to go up to the top and select Bill Payment from the top menu. And you'll see that we have two options here, pay a company and pay an individual. For this particular example, we're going to make a payment to Central National Bank, so we're going to go with pay a company. We're going to type in the payee name, which is Central National Bank. Account number, we don't have an account number for this example, so we're just going to put in slash A. Type in the address, the city, the state, and the zip code, and then we're going to select search. What this is going to do is it's going to search to see if a company is set up within the electronic bill payment network to receive electronic payments. And you'll see this message down here says, there are no matching electronic payees. So we're going to set this up for a check payment, which means that an actual check is going to be sent in the mail to this particular company, or Central National Bank for this example. We're going to add the phone number here and then select Submit. And you can see here that we've successfully added our payee, and the type has indicated a C for check. So to pay them, we select New Payment, go down here and select our payee, Central National Bank. If you had more than one payee, they'd all be listed here. Select Continue. And here we're going to type in the amount of our payment. For this example, we're doing $1. You can select the account that you'd like for the payment to come out of. You can also schedule your payment date. As you can see, you can schedule payments a number of days into the future. For us, we're just going to select the 25th. And if you needed to type in a memo message, you could do that here, but we're going to leave that blank. Select Continue. It's going to ask us if we'd like to confirm this payment. Again, it shows up with the information to review. We're going to select Confirm. And now it tells us we've successfully added this one-time payment. It gives you a confirmation number and you can print this page out for your records. Or you can write down the confirmation number on your bill. So let's say that you really enjoy paying Central National Bank and you want to set up a monthly automatic recurring bill payment to Central National Bank. You can actually set that up within BillPay. So, we're here on the main bill payment screen. You'll want to select New Payment. And you'll notice here the default is Quick Payment. We're going to select this other option here to the right, Add Payments. And so, here's where we'll actually set up the recurring bill payment. Down here, you'll notice that we get to select which account that we want the payment to come from. You also get to select the payee. Of course, we just have this one payee set up. Enter the amount, a memo if you need to reference something for the receiving company. And since this is automatically happening, you can set it up to alert you when the payment is processed. It'll send an email to the address we have that's tied to your Centernet login. For frequency, you've got a number of options. We're going to select monthly. And you can also schedule which day of the month you want it to happen. Or if you always want it to happen on the last business day of the month, you can select this option over here. And then again, you can select an expiration date for the payment, or you can set it to no expiration date. Payment description. If you need a reminder of why you're paying, you can enter that here. And then select Submit. And it tells us that we've successfully added a monthly payment to Central National Bank. And it gives us a confirmation number, which again, you can write down or print for your records. So let's say that you need to delete an automatic bill payment. You can actually do that from the Schedule Payment screen by selecting Delete here on the right. It asks if you're sure you want to delete it. Select Delete one more time, and it confirms that you've successfully deleted the payment. 
And that's how you can simplify paying those pesky bills. If you would like additional assistance, please contact our customer service department.